Wow, such beautiful country. <laughs> it's so cool just trying to drive somewhere and find somewhere to fish in a place I've never been. I literally just picked a lake on a map and now I'm going. So far so good. So we had some historic forest fires last year and this area certainly did bear the brunt of a good portion of those fires. It's just incredible. You know, it's beautiful in its own way, but also tragic when you consider all the people that lost their homes or structures in the fire. But it certainly does make for just this incredible landscape. There she is. Wow. That couldn't be more picturesque. That's incredible. So you know what's cool about this place? One, I've never been here. And since I have never been here and it's getting pretty late, you can kind of see the sun just starting to go over the ridge there. I need to invest the time just kind of seeing what I can see. So I've got uh, my five wit with me. I've got a chronomid and I've got a San Juan worm, which always seem to do pretty well on lakes. But how cool is it? Never fished here, it's completely foreign. I haven't seen any fish rise. I'm gonna fish the bank here. I just don't have time to pull the float tube out. I think uh, I'll come back here in the morning and invest uh, a good part of the day fishing this because it certainly looks good. But anyway, let's go see if we can catch a fish this evening. Let's do this fish on. See those things? Those, I believe, are little scuds. Remember we talked about reading the signs, maybe that's what I need to tie on. All right, I'm gonna pay attention to the signs and let's see, looking in my box. Hmm. Trying to find a scud pattern that's up in that box. Scuds right here. This is what I saw swimming around. So I'm going to tie that on instead of the chronomid. See if it works. All right. I got the scud tied on below the San Juan worm. Let's see if I can get one to eat. Two hours later. Wow, what a gorgeous lake. I cannot wait to invest some time. And I appreciate you coming out. And I know it's not always about catching fish. It's really just getting out here and enjoying fly fishing and, and being outside. And some, sometimes it's just, it's almost spiritual uh, when I'm out here fly fishing. It's tough to explain. I, I'm sure some of you probably understand what I'm, what I'm trying to say, but it's not always about catching fish and that's okay. And I hope you enjoyed this video and this uh, coming out here to this brand new lake with me, despite the fact that I didn't land a fish. But let's hope for better luck uh, tomorrow. I'm fairly confident with a day's investment, I'll get something to in the net, but just so awesome just to be out here and explore this new area and just being by myself and it's pretty incredible. 
but I really appreciate you uh, joining me tonight and uh, yeah, we'll see you on the next video. All right, everybody, fish on. <laughs>